In this video, I'm gonna show you how to crop an element, photo, or video. So to start, I'm just going to select a size for my design, and then I will show you how to crop elements, photos, and videos. Let's just grab a random element here, something that is catching my eye. Let's do this one. Okay, so to crop, basically what you do is you select the element, you click on it, then in this menu up here at the top, you will see the word crop. So you're gonna click on that. And then now you have the option to use the crop handles to kind of crop where you want the design to go. So if you wanted to cut out some of the extra background, you can kind of play around with this and control it based on the handles on the corners of the little design. So you could decide how you want to crop it like this. You can also not only do the free form, but you can select an aspect ratio. So if you wanted it one to one, you could click that and then you could decide how to move around your design in that. And of course, if you have it in this method and it's not showing everything that you want, you can drag around the image, the graphics, the element, and then you can also use the little edges on the underside, click on those, and then an arrow comes up and you can drag it down to make it fit again. There are a lot of different aspect ratios included. So there's the one to one, there's the 16 by nine, nine by 16. So if you were doing a TikTok or a style like that, you could make sure something fits there. Five by four, four by five, four by three, three by four, three by two, and two by three. You can also do a smart crop. If you click the button at the top, it will do a smart crop for you and it will kind of select what they think is the best option based on the ratio that you've selected. So you can pick, let's say 16 by nine. And right here, it shows a random selection and you can click smart crop and it will kind of try to make a better selection for you. And then when you're happy with it, you click done. And that is how it crops. It works the same way for photos. Let's select a photo and put it on here and say we want to only have this water bottle showing. So to do the crop, you would select the image, then go up to crop, click on crop, and then you would either use the crop handles to drag and drop it exactly how you want it, or you can select an aspect ratio that you think would fit and kind of play around with the edges until you have it exactly how you want it. So you can make the photo behind it as big as you need to fit the crop how you want it. So let's say you liked it like that, and then you would just click done when you're happy with the crop. So now you have an image of just the water bottle if that is what you needed. Great thing is it also works on videos. So they have amazing technology on Canva. And if you want to crop a video, it works very similar. You select the video. Once you have it in your design, you go up to the top, you click crop, and then you have the same options for aspect ratios. So let's say you were changing it from the horizontal to a nine by 16 for like TikTok and you wanted this cute dog and the lady petting it in the video, you can drag the video over to include what you want. So you can get both of them in there so that it shows them and then click done. And suddenly you have a video that is cropped to the design size that you need for the platform that you need. As a bonus, if you want to change your design from a horizontal to fit this new style that you have, you can always go up to the resize button, which is a Canva Pro feature, but honestly it is so worth it because it makes things really super fast to resize. So you would just type in the different style that you want. So in the list, you would either click the photo mode if you're doing a photo nine by 16 or video where it has the same aspect ratio. And then you would do copy and resize. So that way you would be able to have your video on the right format when you export it. So on the resize, you would just click on the video and then on the edge, drag the video until it fits the whole size. So that way you can export it as the perfect size video with the correct ratio that you're wanting. This is how to crop in Canva. You can do it on elements, photos, and videos. You can't crop GIFs or embeds, but 
You can do pretty much everything else. And you can also crop things into shapes by using frames. If you wanna watch that video, you can jump over to it on my channel. I have a video all about how to use frames in Canva.